Yo guys and welcome back to this new Peter Hill on the channel and on today's video I will be discussing the Bitcoin price action where we are currently forming a very significant pattern on the one hourly candles because we are right now creating a continuation pattern of this descending triangle you can see the top side providing the resistance the lower side providing the support and we are currently already seeing several touch points getting made here in this significant yeah descending triangle and this is going to be a very important level to pay your attention towards right now here because this will be signifying where bitcoin will be most likely heading towards on the next 24 to 48 hours so guys if this sounds interesting for you make sure that you're first of all going to smash up the like button because we will be revealing where bitcoin is of course heading towards as well make sure to smash up the like button if you want to be seeing crypto content going even more viral because the more people that are going to make that like button blue right now here the more viral cryptocurrencies videos will be going here in the youtube space here so will be highly appreciated for me and of course to help out the whole space as well if you're interested in these next moves and if you don't want to be missing out on all these trading signals you have to be following us and uh, subscribing to our channel right now here with the bell notification ring there so you're not going to miss out of it of course so with that out of the way let me start off with discussing the Bitcoin price action. So, like I told everyone in the intro, we are seeing right now, of course, quite a lot of touch points getting created here on this descending triangle. And even though, if you're, of course, not going to uh, take this uh, left side here of resistance in approach here, because, yeah, previously we found of course some resistance on this level on the one hour then of course we got supported by it of course we saw another uh, rejection by this level another rejection once breaking above it support 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 and once again another time support this of course the 49.5 um 49.7 k level this is an extreme important level uh, for Bitcoin to, to hold on towards. And if we're going to basically fail to hold on towards this level on the one hourly candles, we are for sure going to see lower price targets getting see here. But as soon as we are breaking the stop side of resistance, we will be seeing, of course, higher price targets getting reached. And right now, I will be revealing um, what is extremely likely for Bitcoin to see here. So first of all, I want to be addressing a descending triangle is generally speaking a bearish bias pattern. But since we're right now, of course, an extreme bull market, um, yeah, sometimes these bearish patterns still tend to break out towards the upside. But still, I will be right now approaching this pattern right now like this. If we're going to see a breakdown on the one hourly confirmation, yeah, you could be for sure look at the short position on the retest of this previous level of support. If we're breaking out towards the upside, you could be looking for a long position as well on the retest. And the reason why I'm saying on the retest here is because that will be giving you the least amount of risk right now here. And of course, Guys, if you want to be trading this, you can be signing up right now here with Bybit in the link description. You could be leverage trading the Bitcoin market here. So if you are going to catch this move towards the upside, and I will be right away give you guys a measured move how much um, percentage this will be here. Of course, depending on where we're going to see a breakout, this is going to be a measured move of 2.2%. And let's say you're using a 20x leverage, you will be making a 45, 48% uh, gain here approximately. Sorry, 44% gain in your portfolio. So Make sure to right away sign up here with the link in the description, guys, as well. You will be right now getting a $3,000 US dollars deposit bonus if you're going to sign up with the link in my description here. Um, Bybit offering you this $3,000 US dollars deposit bonus right now. Um, if you're going to sign up here and after that, withdraw your uh, deposited funds here, you have a free deposit bonus. So make sure to check that out there definitely worth to sign up here right now uh, make sure to, uh, to to check the rules and agreements and requirements here and um, in the of course on the site there so make sure to already sign up here definitely definitely worth uh, to do so because you could be trading this move as well towards the upside or towards the downside of course always trading at your own risk for sure and make sure to do your own research like always so um personally i do think uh right now that we uh, can be seeing of course a move towards the upside or towards the downside but i do still think it is more likely to see a breakdown of this because yeah we are right now seeing a descending uh, triangle if we're looking back to previous price action on bitcoin descending triangles tend to more uh, likely break out towards the downside yeah maybe we are going to get another touch out the 50.5k here of that maybe we're going to consolidate in this pattern and maybe we are even going to not see um, this breakout here in the coming four hours or so because yeah for sure we could be as well see this breakout tomorrow because we still have another 23 hours in this pattern but usually it's going to be extremely likely to see a breakout before reaching the apex and usually at 70 percent of the apex you're seeing a breakout so right now we're of course one day and 20 hours in this uh channel and the maximum time here is two days and 19 hours so i do expect here in the let's say coming four hours or coming eight hours we're going to see a breakout of this pattern so yeah it's most likely going to happen today so make sure that you're going to check this out at least here as well guys um we have been already updating you guys about this here you can see upper sloping support line was getting created on bitcoin um we were failing to hold on towards this upper sloping support line and you can see over here yesterday while we were breaking below it we went for a retest on the top side we got rejected and we started to move down from there on and as well 
Project Anchor, we see basically um, that Bitcoin is in a downtrend on the one hourly candle. So Bitcoin is forming lower highs along the way, uh, along the way right now here. And as long as we're seeing this downward trend getting um, yeah, created here, I will be remaining a little bit more bearish. And of course, as soon as I'm seeing bullish divergence or um, a bullish signal right now playing out here i will be for sure keeping you guys up to date about what we are going to see here um we're right now still forming uh yes the same lows here and a little bit of higher lows here on the macd so the macd is signifying right now okay we're seeing the selling pressure cooling off ever so slightly um on the rsi i'm not seeing it yet here so yeah, we'll be for sure remain a little bit more calm here. But as soon as we're seeing a trend reversal signal in the one hour, um, I will be giving you guys, of course, a heads up here on my Twitter page. So make sure to already follow me here at RoverCRC. Um, if you're going to follow me right now here on Twitter, you're definitely not going to miss out on the next major move Bitcoin is about to get creating here. And of course, if we're seeing a trading opportunity, I will be dropping it there uh, as well. Because yes, I told everyone yesterday that we were most likely going to go for a rejection from left that point, And we started to move down already since um, getting rejected by that level. So very in interesting. So if you're as well going to look right now on the bitcoin chart um on the daily candles guy uh, on the weekly uh, weekly chart it is looking very interesting because guys we are right now 15 minutes away uh, sorry 15 hours away before closing the weekly candle here um for bitcoin is going to be quite important to see this uh, weekly candle getting created here and uh, let me see this real quickly. Um, what is going to be very important for Bitcoin is, of course, to close this weekly candle above the 49.2k here. So um, we want to be seeing Bitcoin holding on towards the support line because if we're not going to be able to hold on towards the support line, we are most likely going to close below the 49.2k here. And we'll be already telling you guys if we're going to see another weekly rejection by the 49.2k this of course the tr third week in a row here that we will uh, be getting rejected by this level and this is not signifying very strong news for me then so uh, make sure that you're going to pay your attention towards this right now here important level to look at um you can see as well the 46.8k is going to be very strong support on the lower side so definitely uh, looks very exciting here. But for me, it's going to be important where Bitcoin will be closing this weekly candle right now here. So um, yeah, let's see how this is going to be end of ending, of course. And uh, let me go back into our this chart real quickly. And let me discuss uh, the next ring right now. So uh, what you can see, of course, on the one early candles, uh, still we'll be talking about um, this important, levels of, uh, important level of the 49p2k as well. Um, like I was already addressing, this is weekly support slash resistance for the weekly. So, of course, still resistance. Um, the right now, the, the one early candles, this will be a level that is going to provide us very strong support. So maybe if we're going to see a touch of this level, we could be right away send the price back to rc 50.4k so make sure to keep your eyes out on that level as well here and um, maybe we can be go back towards let's say the 49.2k then go for a rejection and then maybe reach the price target that will be as well very likely for me to see so um yeah make sure to keep your eyes on my uh, eyes out on my twitter page so you're definitely not going to miss out where the market is most likely heading towards of course so and then as well, I want to be talking about the rising wedge on Bitcoin currently getting great here. This rising wedge, of course, uh, like you can see here, resistance, resistance, um, support, 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 uh, three, uh, one, two, three, four, five touches. Uh, these levels, of course, providing very strong support along the way up here. And uh, right now, it looks to be, of course, we're getting rejected by the top side. We are starting to move down, of course. And right now, we're seeing a little bit of sideways action for Bitcoin. And, um, of course, it's weekend. Weekends are usually more sideways. And uh, definitely looking forward towards where we're going to end, of course, the next... Um the next uh yeah of course the next days here because guys if we're looking back towards the previous uh, uh previous monday it was a pretty red monday here so let me see here um this was the 6th of september if we're going to go back seven days here guys you can see over here um the previous monday we were seeing an approximately correction of um let me see an approximately correction of 4.3 percent here so usually mondays are pretty red here in bitcoin so make sure to keep your eyes out on it um definitely very interesting what's going to play out over there maybe we're going to see a pump maybe a correction but if you're looking to this rising wedge right now on bitcoin um looks to be that's going to be more likely to see a breakdown of that point here so pretty interesting to see it over there as well still guys we'll be addressing it yes i did to, uh, took some profits out of bitcoin because i'm currently seeing a huge amount of um, momentum shifts getting played out here behind the charts of course the daily candles is a lacking indicator and usually it tends to take some time before bitcoin is going to react towards it i would love to see bitcoin increasing since i only sold 20 to 25 percent of my portfolio but if we're going to start decreasing, I will be using this capital, of course, to accumulate more Bitcoin to, of course, in the end of the day, have a bigger position. And, of course, to even make more gains in the market, because I do think a 10 to 20 percent correction is going to be inevitable for Bitcoin. Um, I, I hope, most likely expect maybe correction back to 44K here, maybe a little bit more steeper and go back towards the 42K here. That's, of course, approximately a 10 to 15 percent correction. 
And personally, it's going to be extremely likely after seeing these uh, huge amounts of divergence currently playing out here on the Bitcoin chart. You have to know Bitcoin chart, the Bitcoin daily chart, uh, if you're seeing momentum shifts on the Bitcoin daily chart, um, it usually tends to take some time here before it's really going to play out here. But for sure, you have to be paying attention towards it right now here. It could be for sure take another few days here, but it can be as well playing out tomorrow. So make sure to keep your eyes out on it. I took some profits right now on Bitcoin. I will be buying back around the 44k range once again here to, of course, catch this next leg towards the upside. Because personally, I do think we will be seeing a minor shakeout and then we start to rally up very quickly because, yeah, we want to be shaking out the last weekends and then we can be, of course, increase in valuation very, very quickly. So make sure that you're going to pay your attention towards it. I do think it's likely to see this scenario right now playing out here because Bitcoin is losing huge amounts of momentum. And I definitely can't wait to see how this is going to be resulting, of course. So, uh, yeah, guys, this was already it basically for today's video here. Of course, we discussed the imminent short term of this um, yeah, descending triangle. This is going to be, of course, very important to pay your attention to watch right now here. Make sure to smash up the like button here if you haven't already. I will be always remembering um, you guys. It's only taking a few seconds of your time. And you will be helping me out for sure. And, guys, thank you so much for watching this amazing new video here on the channel. And I'll check you guys on the next one. Peace out.